not designed to sell, it's designed to win. Designer John Gidding has $2,000 and a solid plan to make sure this sale measures up. This better work. You've got some amazing curb appeal going on right here. You've got a creek right on the other side of this fence. That's a great thing to have because the sound of running water is something people are really drawn to. Black is the new black. Oh, oh yeah, baby. This house is going to sell really fast. I hope so. Yeah, it's pretty sturdy if it can hold me. <laughs> I would have never thought about that. It all that. comes together somehow. Well, see, that's why you guys are here. <laughs> Tango lessons on the hearth next week. All right. Here's John Gidding. John, Yay! nice to have you. Hi, John. How, How are, are you? you? As great. soon as you turn the computer off, it turns all your peripherals off. No kidding. Yeah. Do you know but what? I don't have a computer. <laughs> I give up. I don't want a computer. If you can't sell it, honey, nobody can. Hey, so just see. Hi, how are you? What I've set up here is kind of a hardscape. So I imagine this is the sort of space someone might set up for a very small patio, a nice little balcony, a cute little bistro set. Okay. Now we're going to actually have a room with identity, whereas before it was part office, part seating area. Now it's a formal seating room, and this is what potential buyers are looking for. Okay. All right. Now all we have to do is move the bed over here, move the dresser over there, and move the étagère over here. That's right. I said étagère. Étagère. That is an étagère, and it moves right here. I'm really advocating a new approach to lighting your home. Okay. Good, Good for you. <laughs> It's you brand new. A yeah. water bottle right in here, and every time you a flush, water bottle. A water bottle. Am I yeah. supposed to drink from it, that later? No. <laughs> it was a brick back in the day, now it's a water bottle, and every time you flush, you save this much water. I am just half a mile away from HGTV's dream home, and this is Sonoma Plaza, where every Tuesday night, the most fantastic farmer's market sets up, and it's the most family-friendly thing you've ever seen, and it's literally going to be in your backyard. I've got an idea for this. Let me know what you think. What's that? What if we were to take these off the hinges and mount them to the wall? Yeah. But on either side of the bed to sort of enclose it, give it an enclosed feel? I actually really, really like that. This is kimono fabric. I love the black. we got to keep these. Yeah, 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 yeah. So on this side of the room, we're going to build a platform and put the king-size bed right on the platform. Oh, Ooh. great. To fulfill the contemporary Asian requirement that the fingers have, we're going to make everything extremely Asian-inspired but with a very modern touch. This is the longest paint job I've ever done in my life. I think it's the longest paint job that's ever been done. Welcome to House Hunters First Time Home Buyers Week. Hi, I'm John Gidding, coming to you from Sonoma, California. We've been here all week at the site of this year's HGTV Dream Home, and I had the pleasure of designing the office. I had a great time putting this room together, but my favorite part of this room is the fact that you can walk right in from the outside. What I love about this is not only is it gorgeous, but it's fully functional. It's got a ton of storage on this side right here, and it anchors the room really well. I'm going to be stuck until midnight <laughs> sewing circles. Listen, that's the beauty about running a sweatshop. <laughs> Oh, it's great because it combines being able to do really cool designs and I try to make it as cutting edge as possible. And I get to help people sell their homes, which is such a fantastic thing. Oh my gosh, thing. they're so happy. I they know they are. are so happy. Rachel, this is a $400 table. I got it for $200 because it has a flaw in it. Can you notice the flaw? Okay, hold on. Well, you're on it, so get off. Okay, now, no, it looks perfect. I was so inspired to do this space and I drew this little perspective right here. It shows the room itself, it shows the plan of the room, and it even shows my little clock art. Always make sure that you know how much sun it's getting, right. and once you've planted them in, water them immediately, and keep watering them over the week, especially if they're in the sun. Now, the great thing about these pillows is, and I want to help, I want you to help me out with this. Flip them around. We're going to switch from a fall color scheme. Stop it! Oh! Look at us. spring color scheme. This is crazy. You are so clever. This is so clever. <laughs> these two? You give me a hard time. I'd love That's to. That's why That's you're here, baby, and you're coming back yeah. next week. By the time you're finished with this guy, they owe you money. <laughs> when you're making a nice table, it's all about creating a little bit of a theme, picking mm -hmm. out some nice colors, mm -hmm. and trying to make it season specific. Flowers. This is your gift for winning. Smell it. Oh, nothing. <sighs> Whatever. Mine is mm. ugly. It smells almost right. as good as you. John, John Gidding. Gidding. Thanks, Thank sweetheart. You. Thank so, you so, so much.